Gary, uh, your final pre-season game, a 4-3 win, what can you take from it? Uh, I thought we were excellent uh, right throughout the game. I thought uh, right from the first whistle we had real intent in our uh, attack and play, the way we pressed, we looked hungry for the game. Uh, the only disappointment would be second half, uh, the, our game management wasn't great. Um, we played in, in the wrong areas and, and gave them soft goals, but overall delighted with, with what we showed and, and looking forward to the real game starting now. I guess from your final pre-season game you wanted one of real intensity and, and you got it. Yeah, we did. I thought both teams played at a real good tempo and uh, you could see, I think, that, that both teams are getting closer to the start of the season and, and getting ready for that. So. Uh, it was a good workout for us and as I said we're, we're hungry and looking forward to, to next week now. Some great creative play to get the goals, I'm going to mention me again, Luke Burke gets the second one, just reward for him, he's doing great. He's doing excellent, yeah, and, and it shows that if, if you come into the team and you play well then, then you stay in the team uh, and he fully deserves to be there with the, with the way he's played in each game that he's been involved in. And Michael Jacobs a, a candidate for free kicks now without a doubt. Yeah, uh, like I said, after all he practices them and it's great to see them come off and, and that can only give you confidence uh, when you score a couple in a row. One or two notable names missing tonight, Stephen Warnock and Nick Powell, what's the situation with them two? Uh, both just precautionary, Stephen's from his kick at uh, Rochdale, he's still struggling a little bit, he should be fine for Monday. Nick, uh, just a tight groin from, from Tuesday night and, and he should be fine for Monday as well. Heart in mouth moment when Will Grigg went down in the far corner, what's the early situation with him? I think he's fine, he just uh, caught a nerve when he got kicked and, and he's kind of felt, not, he lost feeling in his foot for a bit but uh, hopefully he should be fine but we'll, we'll see how that goes over the weekend.